Often when we're calculating statistics, we don't have the individual data values listed out, but instead, repeated data values are listed with their frequencies marked. When we have frequencies marked with our data, and we want to calculate the mean, we need to calculate what's called a weighted mean based on those frequencies. If the values are listed with frequencies, frequencies are how often it occurs. We'll use f for frequencies. It's going to change our formulas slightly. Our formula for the parameter mu is going to be equal to the sum of the x values times the frequencies divided by the population size, which we find by getting the sum of the frequencies. Very similar with x bar, the sample mean. That's the sum of the x's times the frequencies divided by the sum of the frequencies. So for example, in our previous video, we were looking at the number of speeding tickets. And originally, I had listed out all the data values individually. But I could have summarized the data values much easier by saying, some people have one ticket, some people have two, some people have three, and some people have four. And then I could list the frequency of each. Three people had one ticket, two people had two tickets, one person had three tickets, and five people had four tickets. If you look at the previous video, this is actually the same data we had before. The number one appeared three times, the number two twice, the number three once, and the number four appeared five times. However, this condenses the data and allows us to calculate the mean directly using that formula that we have listed above. Notice the formula starts with x times the frequencies, and we have to sum that up. So we're going to make an additional column here for whatever x times the frequency is. We're going to multiply x times the frequency. So 1 times 3 is 3, 2 times 2 is 4, 3 times 1 is 3, and 4 times 5 is 20. The formula for x bar says we want to take the sum of the x times frequency column. So if we add these up, we'll get the sum of the x times frequency column is 3 plus 4 plus 3 plus 20 gives us a total of 30. In the denominator, we also need to know what the sum of the frequency is. So we'll add up the frequencies to get the sum of the frequencies. 2 plus 3 plus 1 plus 5 is 11. So now if I want to calculate x bar, the average, I take the sum of the x times f's, which was 30, and divide by the sum of the frequencies, which was 11. And you'll notice that will give us the exact same answer we had before of 2.7, but it was probably a little bit easier and quicker to calculate when we had the frequencies listed. Weighted means are a valuable way to quickly calculate the mean when numbers appear a repeated number of times.